What's up guys, Cut Pro Tiger is here. Today I'll be doing a deck profile on my Dungari Unlimited deck. Uh, basically the owner is David, it's not mine. So make sure you unlike, don't dislike this video. No, I'm just kidding. Ooh. Just joking, I'm just joking. Okay, so um, yeah, this is Dungari's new form, the uh, Dungari Unlimited. Oh my god, English words on Japanese cards. Yeah, that's so Okay, so, um, so yeah, David, so what's the effect of Dungari Unlimited? He played for? It's pretty much a okay. The first effect is actually a limit break, uh, which happens on attack. So uh, normally people activate the effect when uh, during the main phase, which is actually incorrect. It is only when declaring attack. That's oh, so why. okay, yeah. So you you only declare uh, declare skill when you attack. Yes. Uh, attack at Vanguard. Okay, but normally you activate the effect when attacking Vanguard. First, uh, basically you must con blast two, and you send the top card of your deck in the bind zone. Okay. okay. Uh, that's the cost. So uh, you get to retire all the rear guards, and for each card in the mind zone, you get to have uh, plus two thousand power. Oh, okay. okay. So uh, normally you normally you ride it on uh, to Dangari, which uh, technically speaking is already worth buying two and buy one with the new starter, which is. Uh, with this new starter here. So uh, you'll be binding three cards. So when you write on top, you'll be binding one extra card. So that's four cards already. After that, you will activate the limit break of Dangari's uh, cross right, the unlimited. So uh, you'll bind yet another card. So three plus one plus one will become five cards, which is an extra 10k power. Plus, you get to burn a card. So by cost of Counter Blast, you get 10k power and get to burn a card. The yes. effect is totally worth it. So and of course it's a cross right, so you have 13k defense if you have Dangari and so, but not not you won't always have it, but even then it's still 11k yeah, by itself. So yeah, so there you go. Um, Dangari Unlimited is actually a very underrated card because it's very fun because it, you can somehow see your Binds as a power bar. I think this this is a fun part to me. So yeah, so Dangari Unlimited that's your skill for Dangari. 2 SP is it? Yeah, 2 yep. SP. So Dangari is, is Bunshin. So yeah, what's Dangari's skill? Sorry, I have no idea. When you ride it, you get to... When you ride it, you get to have uh, buying the top 2 cards of the deck to the buying zone. And uh, his limit break is you get to count last one and send one of the buying cards. Bind up with this card's effect back into the bottom of the deck. Uh. And you get to retire one of the opponent's rear guard. So basically, uh, you get to retire one of the opponent's rear guards. Uh, for one card of blast, which Ross. is very cheap, but uh, its drawback is that uh, you get to when there's no cards in the bind zone with this card's effect, uh, you minus uh, two thousand. But the we, we, but the good thing about it is that with this card, normally it only become a nine k rear guard on right. uh, regardless, cause yes. you only you only be able to buy cards with this card's effect as a rear guard. Yes. But with this card, even as a when you call as a rear guard, you still get to buy one card. Oh. So as long as that card is in the buying zone forever, even if this card gets retired, that buying card will not disappear. So it will still become an 11k wheel. Ah, I see. So and this is a new key card of the deck. Uh. Yes. Uh, oh. And not just that. Another interesting thing to note is that, unlike other 11k's, right, you do not minus 2k if you put in uh, other uh, other clan rear guards. So you you can put it into clans that uh, do not have an 11k uh, vanguard as a, as a, some kind of like a 11k uh, defense. Uh. Ah, I see, see. It's a very good card actually. So it's a splashable card like, in a way. Uh. So now with the new, actually with the new starter, this, this card is even more flexible because you won't lose a 9k so easily. Not just that, you get to activate its effect twice without using the 2k as a vanguard, ah. which is important uh, because 11k defense and 9k defense is a lot of difference. Sure, sure. Alright, so yeah, let's go. So for Burning Horn Dragons, finally they have a burning own very own burning horn. When you control a um, Dangari unit, you gain some uh, 3k Dangar, Dangar, Dangar. Dangar. Okay. Yeah. So one Thunder Boom Dragon, four Thunder Boom, and three Red River. No, two. Oh, two Red River. Two so, uh, Thunder Storm. But pretty much they are just vanilla, uh, but they are good because they are well, they are vanilla. My, which my friend like right, to confuse my opponents, so they yes, play different. Pretty much. Uh. To Garuda, mm. because unflip. You unflip, uh. so if actually you hit after you unlimited, you get to activate your skill three times instead of two times within yeah. the game. Uh. True, true. It's good. And to to Death Sky because you need early control. Early control, okay. Mm. Just in case, because uh, it's a very flexible deck in terms of the yeah, like our Berserk Dragon, Counter Blast 2 retire a Great 2 or below. A great two or below unit. So our great, great ones is 4 Red Reaver. Red Reaver, Dragon. Red Reaver with 1 alternate art. Is it? Yeah, alternate. Well, Everything is to confuse your opponent. Yes, yes. confuse your opponent. Oh my god. Even, even when I'm doing the profile, I'm confused. It's a good thing though. Let's see. Uh, four perfect guards. Four perfect guards. Uh, good, thing, wait, uh, good thing is that you, of course, because this is not eradicated, that you can use your cheap, uh, non, uh, non eradicated perfect guards. Which is good. 
Soul and three Phoenix. Three Rising Phoenix. Which is uh, right. Soul Blast 2, draw 1, which is. Well, it's a good card because you get a free card for yeah, calling in. And uh, one one Ryan and one of this. Well, actually, I want to put on this, but uh, two of the Ryan because. Uh, it, normally, stopping one intercept could actually win you the game because of our opponent needing losing 5k shield ah, uh, near the end. But uh, since I cannot find, so I'll be running on this and this. Uh. But it's still 7k booster, so it actually works with your 11k Dangari and your yeah. cross right as a real card for 18k power lines. True, true. So let's go on triggers. So the trigger lineup is very, very special. One, Hamanko. Four, four, genie. Four genies. Obviously, three of these Kabanko. Uh, uh, which is eradicator form. And four. Four. So how many crits are there in total? Twelve. Twelve. So the twelve crit crit build is very good because this deck actually rate me just now. So <laughs> very good. And four and heals. Four heals. Uh, and very special one is the. Uh, two you of play. Why you play two is because uh, it against certain decks like uh, Kagero and Narukami. They can snipe their back row. So normally, uh, they will, sometimes they will snipe this in order to screw up your Dangari. Uh, uh, so you play extra one. And uh, no, and uh, it's also in a pinch, it's also a tanky shield. Uh. Yeah, true. It's very good. I think it's because this card is uh, yeah. And uh, the Cheetah. thing is that they stack. So in case, for example, let's say you call... Wait, uh, wait, where's, where's, yeah, where's, two where's, where's, on the field can actually... Put two in the giant zone. Ah uh, yeah, whenever you call. Uh. Ah, okay. So uh, like for example, let's say let's say this let's say you 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 have two of these and you you four. write right. the original Nari, yeah. you bind four cards. So you can use it like actually you can use it effect three times without using the uh, the the two K uh, from Elect without using eleven K uh, bonus. True true. And of course you will get the fewer your unlimited for the finisher uh, if you get him. Uh. Ah true true. Uh, that's pretty much it. Uh. Yeah, it's a very good choice. Okay, so I hope you guys enjoyed the deck profile on my friend David's um, Dungari Unlimited deck. Please subscribe and add me on Facebook for more deck opening and deck reviews. So, peace out. So, this is box opening, right? Peace out. <laughs>